this is the second problem from exercise 6.1 so see student what he is asking write the first four terms of the ap when the first term small a and the common difference small d are given as follows so again there are some bits in the second problem student now we have to solve one by one this is the first one a is equal to 10 comma d is equal to 10 so both are 10 he has given so what he is asking find to find a student write the first four terms the first two four terms are a1 comma a2 comma a3 and a4 these are the first two four terms so first term is a1 itself a1 is equal to a that is 10 student second term is a2 a2 is a plus d a is 10 and d is also 10 that is 20 and the third term is a3 it is a plus 2d a value is 10 plus 2 into d value is also 10 that is 10 plus 20 is 30 so see student a3 is equal to a plus 2d so a value is 10 plus 2 into d value is also 10 10 plus 2 into 10 is 20 10 plus 20 is 30 so fourth term a4 is equal to a plus 3d that is a value is 10 plus 3 into d value is also 10 student 10 plus 3 into 10 is 30 10 plus 30 is 40 so student a3 a4 and a2 we can find this a3 like this a3 is also equal to a2 plus d student a3 is also equal to a2 plus d so a2 plus d a2 is 10 and d is 10 sorry a2 is 20 student a2 is 20 and d is 10 which is 30 like this we can find so a4 also a4 is equal to a3 plus d student a3 is 30 plus d is 10 that is 40 so a3 like this we can find so you you can find using the formulas these formulas are these so those are these two are the different student so these four are the first four terms therefore the first four terms are the first four terms are so what are the first four terms student 10 comma 20 comma 30 and 40 so these are the first four terms student so by using a and d values we have found first four terms of the arithmetic progression so student this is the second bit in the second problem he has given a equal to minus 2 d equal to 0 is asking to find us the first four terms so see student how can we find first term is a1 which is a only is equal to minus 2 second term a2 is equal to a plus d student a plus d so a value is minus 2 d is 0 minus 2 plus 0 is minus 2 third term a3 is equal to we can write a plus 2d or it is also equal to a2 plus d a2 plus d in both the ways we can write that is minus 2 plus 0 again minus 2 only so a2 is minus 2 again 0 minus 2 plus 0 a4 is equal to we can write a3 plus d student a3 value is also minus 2 d value is 0 it is also minus 2 therefore the first four terms are the first four terms the first four terms are minus 2 comma minus 2 comma minus 2 and minus 2 so since the common difference is 0 all terms are equal here so this is the second bit student in the second problem so next third bit a is equal to 4 d is equal to minus 3 a is equal to 4 d is equal to minus 3 again we have to find the first four terms so the first four terms are a1 comma a2 comma a3 and a4 so first a1 is equal to a only it is 4 a1 is a it is 4 
and the second term a2 is equal to a plus d a value is 4 plus d value is minus 3 4 plus minus 3 so that is 4 minus 3 which is one student in the same way a3 is equal to we can write a2 plus d a2 plus d so a2 value is 1 plus d value is minus 3 a2 value is 1 plus d is minus 3 so it becomes 1 minus 3 which is minus 2 so next fourth term a4 is equal to we can write a3 plus d again a3 value is minus 2 plus d value is minus 3 student so it becomes minus 2 minus 3 which is minus 5 so these are the first four terms student therefore the first four terms are the first four terms the first four terms are so what are the first four terms 4 comma 1 comma minus 2 and minus 5 so these are the first four terms in the third bit student student fourth bit in the second problem he has given a equal to minus 1 d is equal to 1 by 2 he is asking to find us the first four terms uh, the first four terms are a1 comma a2 comma a3 and a4 so we have to find those four terms uh. so see student how can we find so solution a1 the first term a1 is equal to a only it is minus 1 and the second term is a2 a2 can be written as a plus d so a value is minus 1 plus d value is 1 by 2 so minus 1 plus 1 by 2 so find the lcm student we can get minus 2 plus 1 divided by 2 minus 2 plus 1 is 1 divided by 2 so this is a2 so next we have to find the third term a3 is equal to a2 plus d student so by adding common difference to the second term we can get the third term a3 is equal to a2 plus d a2 value is minus 1 by 2 plus d value is plus 1 by 2 minus 1 by 2 plus 1 by 2 we can get 0 student a3 is 0 so next to fourth term a4 is equal to a3 plus d so by adding common difference to the third term we can get the fourth term a3 plus d a3 we have 0 plus d value is 1 by 2 0 plus 1 by 2 is 1 by 2 so therefore the first two four terms are the first four terms are the first four terms are student uh, in the second method we can find a3 can be written as a plus 2d so we have to substitute a and d values to get a3 so in both the ways we can find student this is very easy so the first two four terms are the first term is minus 1 and the second term is minus 1 by 2 third term is 0 and the fourth term is 1 by 2 so these four are the first four terms of the given ap student so next fifth bit in the second problem so a is equal to minus 1.25 comma d is equal to minus 0 0.25 again he is asking to find us the find us to first four terms of the ap so the first four terms are a1 comma a2 comma a3 and a4 so i have to find a1 is equal to a only that is minus 1.25 so and the second term a2 is equal to a plus d a2 is equal to what student a plus d so here a value is minus 1.25 plus d value is minus 0 0.25 so minus 0 0.25 so it becomes uh, minus 1.25 minus 0 0.25 so plus into minus minus student so minus 1.25 minus 0 0.25 is minus 1.50 this is the second term so next third term a3 is equal to we can write a2 plus d by adding the common difference to the second term we can get the third term so a2 values we have minus 1.50 plus d values minus 0 0.25 minus 0 0.25 
So by simplifying minus 1.50 plus into minus, we can get minus 0.25 minus 0.25. So here uh, minus 1.75 student. Next, uh, A4 student. A4 is equal to A3 plus D. Again by adding common difference to the third term, we can get the fourth term. So A3 we have minus 1.75 plus d is minus 0.25 minus 0.25 so it becomes a minus 1.75 minus 0.25 it is 0. Point, uh, sorry so it be it becomes minus 2.00 minus 2.00 therefore the four terms are the four terms are so what are the four terms? The first term is minus 1.25 and the second term is minus 1.50. Third term is minus 1.75 and this is the first term minus 1.25. This is the second term minus 1.50. This is the third term minus 1.75 and this is the fourth term minus 2.00. So these are the four terms. Sir. By using A and D values, we have found student. So, there are 5 bits in the second problem, student. These are the 5 bits. Sir.